Hello, this is Mr. Question Mark, and today I'm going to show you how to build my 31st edition Lego puzzle box. And feel free to pause the video at any time you need to, because you probably will need to if you're building this. Um, and enjoy. So, we start out here with a 6 by um, 6 by 12 base or whatever you can do for that. See, I don't even have one here. And then we need bricks right there in a 2 by 8 area. And then bricks along here in a 2 by 12 area, just all across the top. Then there's a 1 by 1 brick right there with a hole in it. It has to have a hole. Tiles right there. And then tiles all along there. There is a tile there, although it kind of... There we go. So, tiles all along there in a 2x7 area. That's 2x4 there, 2x4 there. So, just tiles around there. And then we get some bricks along there and along this bottom portion, along both of those parts. Then we're going to set this to the side. And you get something similar to a six by six by twelve base, but um, you leave a hole in it right there, two by two hole there. What I did, this is just a suggestion. You don't have to use it, but um, what I did, I did two two by sixes there, a four by six, a two by four, and another two by six. So you could do. Um, maybe a 6x6 six six there and a 2x6 six six or a 4x6 there and a, or you could do a bunch of 1x6's whatever you want um, and then a bunch of bricks here there's nothing right there in that 1x2 area there there's a 2x2 two two brick there and bricks all along there then what you want to do is get a some plates and build them right there in a 2x2 two two area and then tiles oops don't let it break tiles here and here like that and yes I know that is a newspaper piece from Lego Alien Conquest if you know that what that is um so yeah then we get this and build it on top of here like this right there with the hole right there right there like that alright so next we're gonna set that to the side and if, then we're going to get plates and get them in a 2x6 area. You build bricks on top of that, or underneath it, whichever you want. And then tiles on top of that. Make sure it's all solid in one piece. So it isn't falling apart or just comes apart just like that. So, set that to the side. Then you get plates and do it like this. This is kind of a 2x4 area just with a hole there. And then you put bricks on top of that and then tiles on top of that. Or underneath it. And the tiles always go on top. Make sure that's all solid. In one piece. And then you get one of these pieces which is a Technic rod that is five studs long. Then for then what you're gonna do is get whatever you can do for two one by two bricks stack them on top of each other a one by two plate and this which is a two by three plate with a two by two tile on it so whatever you can do for that then brick right there and tiles on top of that and there you go so like that you put that to the side. Um, then this is treasure. You can do whatever you want for treasure, but it has to be a one by seven plate, which does not exist. So I used a one by six and a one by one. You could use a one by four and a one by three. Just anything you want to do. And tiles on there that are treasure like. And of course, that for the excess. Um, then what you want to do is take this piece and put it in right there like that or actually not yet not yet don't put that in there yet because there's still more bricks on the top of here 
tell you about bricks. All along here, like this. Oh, actually, yes, you do. You do build that in there. You do put that in there. And then, so build bricks. Let's see. Over that hole there. Tiles right here in a 1x7 area. Just like your treasure. Right there. 1x7. And then bricks across the top. And in that little area as well. So then, you're just going to build plates across the top. Now I'm going to try to do this really fast because there's not very big plates here. Oops. Hopefully I can do this really fast for you. Okay. So now we have this. This is your main piece, and that piece is not going to fall out there. That's part of the puzzle, that pushing there. <laughs> uh, so this piece is going to go this right there. You're going to pull up, get your, jam your fingernail underneath that tile right underneath it. In my case, it's a green, lime green tile, because I bought off of eBay 50 of them, and I've used a bunch. But that was a while ago, though. So now, you can't, oops. Just try to make sure it doesn't really shake out, really. Or anything. Anyways, let's move on. Then, there are cross axle put into that hole there in the brick on that part. Then this part over it. Like this, like that, so then it's all solid like that. Then this will go into here, and if you did it like mine where that part isn't treasure, put your treasure side first. But if it's all treasure, then don't worry about it. So there you go, you're done. Now for the puzzle, the puzzle part of it, you're going to push on this part, and this part will come out, and it will push this out. Now don't put that in that hole because it will just fall in there and you'll lose. You have to push that little thing and that little thing, it will move the hole, basically. Then if you push it in there, it just sticks in there but it kind of falls out. So if you push it more, dump that back out, then this will pop out and there's your prize. So also, that kind of, this when you push that back in there, it can kind of um, push in more than you want it to to look like make it look like it's part of the wall. So make sure it's looks like it's part of the wall. And then you can put this back on. Ah, oopsie! I just broke that tile out, <laughs> the lime green one. So yeah, and then be sure to. Lift up on tiles, jam your fingernail underneath, and also these tiles around this piece as well, because they are important as well. This isn't crucial, but um, you can do that one. Alright, and there you go. See ya.